I will be making a public service announcement on Malaskan Contagiosum virus. It, it is a skin infected caused by pox virus and it can be transmitted through sexually transmitted through skin to skin contact or cuts. The most common for adults is sex, sexually sexual contact and another way could be also transmitted by such as towels and clothing that touch that comes in contact with the cut and and such as swimming pools and and taking a sharing a bath with the with the infected person could also cause transmission of that virus and it could also be touching touching the cut and touching other parts of your body can also transmit that virus to spread and the prevention would to avoid touching the skin cuts and do not do not share towels with other people avoiding sex can also prevent the uh, Malaskan virus and other STDs wash your hands and don't scratch or pick up don't scratch or pick at Malaskan bumps keep bumps covered at all times and the treatment you will use is usually a self-resolving treatment and it, the lead and the cuts are, are removed they are removed by either surgically or uh, chemically or by chemical ag agents such as iodine silver nitrate or phenol and they are, there is also another way called cry cryotherapy which is it's which involves the freezing freezing the infected cells and which pretty much kills it by pressurized by pressurized liquid spray but the the only bad side down for it is that lesions can also re can also re cure but there's not a uh, specific why how it can re cure but it re cures by it's, it might be due to reinfection subclinical infections or or reactivation of latent infection symptoms symptoms that could cause is that skin skin disease they call it small it is a small white pink flesh bump that has a dimple in the center it looks like almost like wax and it's frequently seen on the face neck or armpits and hands but not on the palms not on the palms or the or the or the soul but in adults is usually found in the genitals the ab abdomen and the inner thighs and the statistics show that it state it is eight percent of the world's population is has been affected with molaskum contagiosum and it's, it, it can be affected by men women and children and the highest is the highest rate of it is found in hot climates and warm climates but the overall infection rates are approximately five to eight percent five to eight percent of the population 20 percent of the people with hiv have molaskum contagious and that will be it for my public service announcement and hope everything is well